Brian, just forget it. Stop that. You need to take care of yourself. Got Mac patched up. Let's take a look at you now. Oh, looks pretty nasty right about here. Uh. <laughs> so, Pitt. You made it. Pitt. Charlotte, right? Put some ice on it. I'm sorry you had to see that fight. What a terrible first impression. Dad, I'm taking Gabe to the station. We need a first aid kit that doesn't predate the discovery of bacteria. It's fine. I don't need to go. Well, Ryan knows what he's doing now. You just go with him. Alex, I'll be back soon, okay? Okay. Well, there goes my bartender and my backup bartender. I love that. It's a falling star? Yeah. Or rising. Depends on the day, I guess. So... What's it doing today? Rising, for sure. First day of my new life. Oh, good. I'm glad Max's stupidity didn't ruin everything. <laughs> I heard Ethan gave you an issue of his comic. He obviously thinks you're really cool. I know literally nothing about kids, but he seems like one of the good ones. I appreciate that. He's my favorite person. By the way, thanks for telling us about the mine. Ethan's not allowed up there anymore. Yeah, no problem. I hope he won't be mad at me. You did the right thing. Beef pie special. Watch the gravy. <laughs> Jed, you didn't have to. Now, Ryan said you're skipping dinner. No starving artists on my watch. I do have to get going. I'm making some pieces for the spring festival, and they have to be done tonight. Sorry I couldn't talk longer. Oh, that's okay. So glad you're here, Alex. I'm looking forward to getting to know you. Yeah, same. Bye. Thanks for supper. Yep. So I'm short-staffed at the moment. Gabe tells me you've worked at a restaurant before. A couple years experience as a server? Uh... Maybe not as long as that, but yeah, I've done lots of things. You want to work a shift? See if you might like it here? Sure. All right. So, we have a few folks that need checking on. Ducky and Diane over there. Steph over here. Uh, there's a table in the back that needs clearing also. You can give the food orders to me, and I'll handle anyone here at the bar. All right? Got it. It's really nice to have you here, Alex. Thanks. Guess I'm a server now. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. My dad was in the service. I should check on that table. Can I get you two anything? Miss Chan, here at last to relieve our suspense. Hi. I am Reginald McAllister, the third, Ducky, 
to friends, former entrepreneur, now retired. And this young woman is Diane. Hey there. Nice to meet you. I didn't realize that... Uh, that we all knew you were coming? Yes. Gabe is generous with uh, both friendship and information. You're from Portland, right? I moved here from D.C. six months ago. How are you finding the small town thing? I've been here one day, and I've already hit my hug quota for the year. <laughs> She's funny. Diane is a geologist, recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. I'm glad there's another newbie around here, too. Can I get you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms, and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. Thanks. My dad was in the service. Hey, Dad. Yeah? I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Go ahead. One cheeseburger with mushrooms. Uh-huh, and? One pie special with fries. Ducky asked for his usual? Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Oh, that's odd. I don't see it. Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Serves him right, if you ask me. But feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. Oh, if you can't find it, Deputy Pike was with them. He might have some idea. He's usually in here around now. Probably arriving soon. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Haven is nice. Just wish it felt like home. Hope we both get there soon. Oh, Typhon's not a bad company once you get used to how they operate. Right. Yeah, that's what people keep telling me. Takes a minute to learn the ropes, though. Huh? Starting over from scratch like this? Yeah, I guess. Fucking terrifying is what it so is. You're telling me. <laughs> Idiosync. Oh, is that really Ryan? I got written up for leaving my phone on. My extensive wilderness map reading knowledge tells me that there is a whole lot of wilderness around here. It wasn't even on me. But I guess it started five. Only 45 bucks for the chance to get mauled by a bear. Everything in my locker went out. Sweet jukebox. I'll have to check out the song sometime. That looks radioactive. Sure, I know. That's the girl from the record store. Steph. Alex, right? I'm Steph. Hey. Just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks though. 
Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. I've got some time now, though, if you want to chat. Is that record store inventory? <laughs> no, it's character stats. Do you know what a LARP is? I've heard the term before. Live action role play. It's like a tabletop role playing game, but acted out in real life. Costumes, foam weapons, beanbag spells, it's great. Gabe was talking about a LARP with Ethan. Yeah, it's next week. They're coming with me. It's their first time. I'm so excited. <laughs> Would you ever want to join us sometime? Sure, I'd try it. If you and Gabe both like it, it must be super fun. Awesome. Is that your shot? What is that? This is bedazzled kiwi schnapps. No one's ever ordered it, so Gabe's trying to get rid of it with the jukebox game. What's a jukebox game? It's like a short version of 20 questions where you're trying to guess a song, guess wrong, you have to take the shot. <laughs> Ryan and I are going to play. You want to take his place? No thanks. <laughs> that shot looks a little too dazzling for me. Okay. Let me know if you change your mind. So... You and Ryan hang out a lot? All the time. Except when he ditches me for Gabe. They went to get first aid. <laughs> Being a hero again. Ryan's always doing that. <laughs> it's a Lucan family thing. Have you heard about Jed's rescue? It was a big deal. Back when he was a minor, he saved- I can't imagine. Alex wants an earload of Haven trivia just now. Sorry, Jed. He doesn't like to brag, but there's stuff about it all over the place if you look. Interesting. I should get back to work. Okay. There must be something around the Black Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Wow. Tetanus anyone? I hope Ryan's got better supplies. Oh, hey. Someone made a course about my life. Still want to hit the trails later this week? Shit. Now Mac's scared. At least he's not freaking out anymore. He won't make me lose control. Yeesh. Glad I'm not a 19th century miner. Haven seems pretty proud of its mining history. Jed asked me to clear that off. Holy shit. Can I talk to you real quick? What do you want? Listen, what happened upstairs was fucked up, right? from both of us. Where are you going with this? Look, Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I, I, I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know?
So you're saying you want me to lie to cover your ass? No. No, just, like, let me handle it. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. We've been together four years. She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. So please, help me out. I don't know, man. Shit. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god, look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? Why do you give a shit? Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. I swear. This is it. You better have a good explanation or... We're done. It's, it's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you! About... why you guys are meeting behind my back. Okay. So, how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me! Okay, um... Not exactly sucker punched, but... He definitely started it. Oh, God. Were you there, too? Yeah, I was there. Max telling you a whole lot of bullshit. You know what? That doesn't even surprise me anymore. So what really happened? Riley. Mac barged in, accused Gabe of sleeping with you, sucker punched him, 
and then kicked him while he was down. Riley, listen. What happened to Mac's face? I did that. Well, good. It sounds like he deserved it. Thanks for telling me the truth, Alex. Wait. Wait, are you... are we okay? Are you fucking serious? I'm so embarrassed by you right now. But are we... still together? What do you think, you fucking idiot? No. Alex Chen? Uh... Assaulting Mac Loudon on your first day here, huh? I'm Jason Pike, the deputy sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you in for questioning. Are you saying I'm under arrest? Your face. <laughs> you should see your face. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, I'm only kidding. Uh, nobody's in trouble here. Right? <laughs> Gabe and I just like to prank each other. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. <laughs> Thanks for being a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Um... Maybe I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? All right, let's see if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. Ducky's whiskey could be one of those. This all looks really fancy, but no rye whiskey. Maybe Ducky left his whiskey up there? Nope. Nothing. Gabe's got a pretty fancy collection. Might as well check in there. Ooh, now I know where the ramen is. No whiskey, though.
I've done what Jed asked me to do. I should see if he needs anything else. Ducky? Jed thinks you took your whiskey up to Gabe's yesterday. Do you know where you might have left it? I remember absolutely nothing of the night. <laughs> really? Maybe check your phone. Did you take any pictures? Call anyone? <clears throat> Have a look. For goodness sake. How do I access the photos on this thing? Nice. Poor Ducky. I shouldn't be reading this. Sorry, nothing useful. Well, thanks for letting me know. My dad was in the service. Wait, Deputy Pike. He's the one who was hanging out with Ducky and Gabe last night. Hey, Alex. Were you hanging out with Ducky and Gabe last night? Who told? <laughs> <laughs> so, Ducky apparently lost his favorite whiskey. Possibly upstairs? Oh, no. You remember seeing him with it? Oh, when I left, he was still down here. Oh, but you know what? You should check Gabe's wall of shame. Might have some incriminating evidence. <laughs> okay, thanks. I will. Well, I've got to get back to work. Later, Alex. Oh, good. Christ, she did that to that guy's face? It's steering clear. Aw. I'm already making friends. This one's from yesterday. Hold up. It was Colonel Ducky on Gabe's couch with the bottle. Found this upstairs, in Gabe's couch. What a relief. Many thanks, Alex. My pleasure, Ducky. Can I pour you a glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. To Miss Alex Chen. A most tenacious detective. To Alex. Cheers. Oh. <sighs> I've done what Jed asked me to do. I should see if he needs anything else. My dad was in the service. Damn boys, always fighting. 
Time to grow up. Should have seen Gabe go at it with Dad. He's come a long way. Behind that mountain man beard, Jed's so obviously a sweet guy. Are you finished up with everything you want to do? Actually, not yet. My dad was in the service. Back again? I'm ready to take you up on that drink. All right. Wait, hey, Jed, can we get, uh... Thanks. And keep it quick. She's on the clock. <laughs> <sighs> you know, your brother's been talking about you getting here for months. I'm starting to get the sense. I even remember exactly the day he found your number. He was telling everybody in this place. Really? Yeah. Pretty heartwarming stuff. Well, I've got to get back to work. Later, Alex. Good talking to you. Good talking to you. Sure, I know. I'm just fin. It's getting better, for sure. Hey, what's up? Okay, I changed my mind. I'm in for the jukebox game. Oh, awesome. So, I'll pick a song. You have five yes or no questions before you have to guess it. Okay. Got one. Jukebox is all yours. So, what do you want to ask me? Hmm. I should flip through these and see what might be good to ask.
When was the last time you listened to this song? So, I guess we're breaking the yes or no questions only rule? Can you handle it? When was the last time I heard that song? Like two days ago. Gabe was working, so Shar and I put it on and danced like crazy to rub it in. That doesn't tell me anything. What did you expect? Is the band name on the cover? Yep. Does the band name have a symbol in it? Like something that's not just a letter? Oh. Yeah, it totally does. Nice. You've got two questions left. Is there an animal on the cover art? Uh, no, no animals. Ugh, too bad. Some of these are really cute to cover. And it could be a dance song. Here's what I know. The band name doesn't have a person's name in it. The band name does have a symbol in it. No animals on the cover. The band name is on the cover. And it could be a dance song. Here's what I know. The band name doesn't have a person's name in it. The band name does have a symbol in it. No animals on the cover. The band name is on the cover. And it could be a dance song. Here's what I know. The band name doesn't have a person's name in it. The band name does have a symbol in it. No animals on the cover. The band name is on the cover. And it could be a dance song. Here's what I know. The band name doesn't have a person's name in it. The band name does have a symbol in it. No animals on the cover. The band name is on the cover. And it could be... Fuck. Nice one. <clears throat> Guess I'm drinking. Thanks for playing. I'm really glad we did. Me too. I should get back to work. Okay. I've done what Jed asked me to do. I should see if he needs anything else. Are you done now? Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. Speak of the devil. How you feeling? Not great. Not awful. I got Alex covering for you. For real? We need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Okay. I think that's enough for today. You did great work. You'll be a damn fine addition to our team. You can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. Thanks. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Time to talk to Gabe. 